are here at McDowell's Cemetery to discuss the local legend with Al Capone, his mistress Flora, and the ties with this cemetery itself. Now, Al Capone was married for almost 30 years, but all during that time, he had many affairs, mostly with burlesque dancers and prostitutes. But his two best known mistresses were silent film star Gladys Walton and Mary Ann Brown, AKA Vera, with whom he allegedly had two daughters, the names Mary and Anne. Now we contacted Deidre Capone, which is El Capone's niece, and we asked her about the name Flora. She does vaguely remember the name Flora coming up in her research about El Capone's mistresses. Now we did research of our own and we could not find any connection to Capone and an actual name of Flora. So we are wondering if Flora is a nickname, just like Mary Ann Brown used a nickname for herself as Vera. Now there are five Floras that are in this cemetery. And with doing research, I was able to rule out all five that are here. Now, could she still be here under her real name instead of a nickname? Absolutely, but right now we just simply have no clue. Now, part of the legend is also with this stone. The legend says that Al Capone purchased the stone for his mistress, Flora. Well, unfortunately, that is not true. What you are seeing is a family marker. And if you walk behind this family marker, you will meet the Flora family. Erastus, who was the father, and he died in 1916. Jane Mom, who died six years before her husband of typhoid fever. And then you have Vincent, a grandchild who sadly died of juvenile diabetes at the age of 16. Now, while this may not be the stone for Flora, as the legend states, this cemetery still has a female apparition that is seen wandering through the cemetery and on the surrounding roads. On top of that, there's also been different colored balls of light that has been seen bouncing throughout the cemetery, even with the naked eye. So even though the legend may possibly not be true, this cemetery is still definitely haunted. Now, if you like this story and want to hear more of other stories throughout Michigan, please hit like on this video and hit the subscribe button and we'll be able to let you know when we have some more videos uploaded. Till next time.